Hello and welcome to the first Lou Mailbox. Catchy name, isn't it? I know. It's absolutely amazing, but there's actually a reason for me starting this series. Because today I received my very first piece of mail from you guys. Here it is. And that's our address. So at least I know now that this was sent to the right people. Someone didn't just send some mail out and it randomly arrived here and I thought it was for me. This is actually for me because my name is on it and my address is here. That's amazing. So, firstly, before I even start and look at this, I need to put the music a bit softer. But, you can find our address, it's a PO box, below. And if you want to send something, do it. I'll make a little mailbox featuring it. I must warn you though, that the mail service, the postal service, whatever you want to call it, is quite slow down here in South Africa. Okay? It's a bit slow. So if you do send something, it might take a bit of time to get here. Who knows? Who knows how long this even took to get here? But it's here now, and that's all that matters. I put the address below. So, let's have a look at this. This one, that's the envelope it came in, and that's, that's super exciting. Okay. From the UK, the United Kingdom, and it's from Zoe. Her nickname is Owit Zoe, which kind of figures. <laughs> and... First, this came with it. It's a random card to keep the envelope straight and has a cute smiley face on it. Pretty exciting. Then, then, moving on to what is actually not really the main attraction because, you know, you'll see why in just a second. Ta-da! That's me and Ride Panda. And there are two Pokeballs and two Pikachus. That is just the cutest thing ever. Well, those. I'm probably not the cutest thing ever, but that's just because it's me. And, I mean, I'm next to Ride Panda. How could I even be cute if she was anywhere near me? It's not. Anyway, it's amazing. I think she got my likeness down quite nicely on paper. And I look so happy there. So that's perfect. And the little Pikachus look happy. Look at the little mouths. I love the little mouths. They're absolutely amazing. And the cute little tails. And the Pokeballs are all over the place. Two cool too cool and now now what you've all been waiting for oh it's new puppy look at him we are actually considering getting this one framed and just hanging it up somewhere in the office we were actually talking before about dedicating a corner of the office to Nero we're gonna hang all his old collars and leashes up in said corner and make a little doggy corner it's gonna be handsome and that is most definitely gonna go there. That is perfect. Those looked quite a lot like us, but that, that's on a whole nother level. That's on a whole nother level. It is absolutely amazing. I don't even know how you did it, but you captured everything that is Nero Puppy perfectly there. Perfectly. Perfectly. I can't say it enough. It is too cool. And that's not the end of it. There's a letter too. We're gonna read it because it's nothing sensitive or personal or anything like that. And it's nice. So that's Nero Puppy. And that's the other one. And I gotta say, she's actually pretty good at this. Because if I had to try to draw anything at all that's not like a little stick man, then it'll come out quite badly. Right Panda knows how to draw. I don't. I don't. But here's the letter. So I'm going to read it to you. And then point the camera at it at the same time. Because that's just how I'm going to do it. <laughs> to Swen. I thought I'd write a little letter to go with the drawings. So here it goes. But wait, actually, I'm not going to do a voice because I know she's a girl. Her name is Zoe. But I feel that I don't want to do a voice and accidentally not sound like her. I mean, I'm a brilliant voice actor. We all know that. Can't you remember from the Path of Exile series? That was too good. But I'm not going to do it in this. They aren't great. But I hope you, Helene, and Nero like them. Smiley face. They are great, and we love them. Nero, especially. He has never had a self-portrait before. Okay, he's never had a, a picture of himself. And we're going to frame this one, and he's going to have it. It's going to belong to him. So this is going to be amazing. He loves it. He lo My parents haven't seen this either. They're going to flip. They're going to love it. Okay. I'd just like to say that the content you put on YouTube is absolutely amazing, and I watch all your videos. Thank you. I'm glad. And 
like, that's amazing. Thank you for watching all the videos. I do put out quite a few videos, so if you do watch them all, then you must be devoting quite a bit of time to actually doing that. But I have to say that personally, I have been spending a lot more time watching videos on YouTube than I have been, say, TV episodes or stuff like that. New media has taken over, what can I say? Now, where was I? You work so hard, and I'm pretty sure every single one of your subscribers appreciates it. So thank you, Swin. Another smiley face. Big, open, wide mouth smiley face. The perfect kind of smiley face. Where were we? I'm bad at reading. I'm not sure what else to say. So, just keep being awesome. From Zoe. Oh, it's Zoe. Arrow, YouTube. In brackets. Wow, thank you very, very much. And... Thank you for being in the pilot episode of the Lumail Box. You made this possible. Zoe, you made this possible. And you made our day. Okay. And that's, that's saying something. Because tomorrow is the Guild Wars Beta weekend. And that wasn't even on my mind today. Because of this. So, there you go. I hope you guys like this. If you guys want to send anything at all, then I'll definitely feature it. If it's food, I'll definitely eat it. I don't know, okay, I don't know how well food actually flies or ships across the ocean. I don't know if the customs actually let food products through to this country. So I don't know about the whole food thing. But if you send anything via the mail, then I will I will show it on the next Blue Mailbox episode. And that said, I'm not sure how often or frequently these are going to come up. It all depends on you guys if you actually send anything. And I probably won't be playing Chrono Trigger soundtrack all the time. I'll mix that up too. So, I hope you guys enjoyed the first episode of the Lumail Box. I am going to put photos of these so you can actually see them in proper quality at the end of this video. I'm going to do it in iMovie on my phone. So, I'm going to do some crazy, crazy editing on my iPhone, which is probably the worst possible idea in the world, but I'm going to do it anyway. I'm going to do it anyway. I'll take photos of all of these things, and you'll be able to see them at the end of the video. Awkwardly at the end of the video. Without any background music or anything like that, they'll just be there. So enjoy that. And thank you again, Zoe, from the UK. Oh, it's Zoe. That's her nickname. And I must say that I like, I, I love that kind of nickname anyway. Because she actually calls herself I Am Ride Panda. She's over there playing Guild Wars. <laughs> she calls herself I Am Ride Panda. And I like that as well. I don't know why, but I feel as if, like, if I had to make another account and call it I Am Swin, then that would be cool as well. But I don't need to. I'm just saying that would be cool. So... Thank you very much, Zoe, and thank you everyone else who has perhaps already sent something that's just not rocked up here yet, because you're going to be making the next Lumailbox episodes happen. It's great, and that's going to be it for this video. I'm actually recording this on Thursday, and I'm probably only going to upload it on Saturday, which, while in itself is a little bit sad, it doesn't really matter, because this is timeless. You can watch it a year from now, and it will still be absolutely amazing, because there are Pokeballs, little Pikachus, portraits of Nero Puppy, and letters, and random cards as well. All of those things make it timeless. So, again, thank you very much. Check back here soon for more Lumail boxes. And you guys can let me know what you think about the name. Be honest. Be brutally honest. Or don't. Say what you think will make me happy, that's fine too. <laughs> that's okay. So, that's it. Check back soon for more. Most importantly though, happy all these things, all these nice goodies. Happy them.